what's going on Hick Squad in today's video we are gonna we're gonna wash this truck we're gonna polish this truck I'm gonna show you guys all my cleaning supplies that I use my wheel cleaner my tire cleaner I got a new power shirt I got a new foam cannon I got a new power sprayer so this video is gonna be awesome so you guys stay tuned all right guys I'm gonna show you a little bit of some stuff that I'm using in this video I got some turtle wax max power car wash and chemical guys citrus car wash and uh, here is my polisher picked this up at Walmart and I picked this up at Walmart picked this when I got my uh, power washer and I got this at Walmart basically everything uh, Basically everything that I'm using is um, bought at Walmart basically. So uh, I'm going to show you guys the power wash here, here in a minute. Show you guys how it works. And uh, we'll get the power spray in this truck. this is my power sprayer I bought it's a uh, predator and it's 212 cc I bought this at Walmart when I bought my uh, when I bought my uh, foam cannon and uh, I've been loving it so far it's been working great I have no complaints I wash this truck before every truck meet or car show I go to and uh, yeah, this power sprayer works amazing. We used it on our concrete on our driveway to get some of the dirt off and the sand off from this uh, dirt road. And uh, just took it right off, no problem. We use it around the house, we use it everywhere. This has to be a really, a good, really, really good power sprayer. And uh, here's my uh, foam cannon all set up and ready to go. So. So we're going to go and foam down this truck and uh, supposed to lay it on, supposed to leave it on the truck for about 5 to 10 minutes and then you take the power spray and you wash it off again. I read the directions in the back of the uh, chemical guys bottle so that's the way you're supposed to do it and uh, we'll see how this soap works, see, see how it cleans, it's supposed to leave a good shine so we'll see how that goes. Here's the truck where it's all dried. 
Here's a microfiber towel. And I ain't worried about these windows because uh, I got some stuff that'll clean these windows up. So I just let them let them be. And only dry the body at the truck. And for the wheels, I use a mic microfiber towel for these wheels. I let them sit here for a little bit, let them dry. And then I go over a microfiber towel and I with some wheel cleaner and I clean them all up. But uh, for the paint, these little smears and all that stuff will be totally gone once I break up my polisher. So I just let the truck sit here for like five to ten minutes, let it uh, let it dry, and then I go over with my fiber towel again, and then I break up the polisher. And uh, I end up polishing the truck, and it looks it's so, the paint is so smooth. Once I break up the polisher and get all done, and I go over with the microfiber towel and all that, the truck is so, the paint is so smooth. So, I'm going to bring out the polisher here in a couple minutes, letting the truck drip dry, and I'll catch back up to you guys. Alright guys, the end of the video. Like, comment, subscribe, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. I'm going to leave the polishing video for tomorrow because there's tons of steps and I don't really don't want to make this video too long because I'm having internet problems and uh, my PC has been down for a couple of days and uh, just want to get this video out for you guys as quick as possible and uh, catch you guys later on the next video. Peace.